again. It's a red stick. Ladies and gentlemen, back with another video. That's the most anticipated video, man. You guys been waiting for. All of you been asking me how to do this. So this is my maiden voyage for my drone fishing. I finally made it to the beach. We're gonna be flying our lines all the way out to the deep end with my Mavic Pro. We're gonna attach the line. If you can see, uh, I don't know if you guys did watch it, my previous video, I explained how it works, so I'm not gonna get into too much detail. I'm gonna go ahead and link it up here. You guys can watch that. I have my down rig, as you can see. Very simple solution. Easiest way, then the cheapest way, and the best way to use your drone to drop your line deep into water. So right here, here's my Mavic Pro. That's the down rig line with the wire lead. And we're gonna throw some live croakers and I got live pinfish and some pigfish as well. So they're gonna be really good bait. And I got live shrimp too. You know, right now the snooks are running on the surf. So I'm gonna send it out all the way. Kinda probably right after the second bar where you cannot really cast. That's what I'm gonna head it to. And that's it, I got two lines, 6,000, that's the battle two, pen, and I got my pen battle to 8,000. These are all my surf reels and rods. I got 10 feet and nine feet. One of them, of course, my favorite, that's the wire lead with the bluefish rig, so I'm hoping for a bluefish. I got three ounce weight and I got a three ounce weight, primitive weight, kind of like a Carolina rig with the mono line, number two circle hook and that's it guys. We have our two rod and reels ready, got the bait ready, got the drone ready. Let's do some drone fishing, <laughs> yeah buddy. Guys, we set our home point. It's ready to go. We got our down rig right there. We're gonna get it closer to the bait and to the line. Lift it up a little bit. Make sure your bail is open. There we go. All right, let's see. Put the line. There we go. We got the line in there. You don't want to put it too deep in. Then you're not going to be able to drop it. And then we just, let's see, accept, make sure everything's okay to fly. We're in the safe flight area. So we're good to go. I'm going to go ahead and put the video and start recording at the same time. Hopefully we'll get some good footage. And we're recording right now. So let's take the drone. The bale is open. Watch for the birds. Go a little higher just in case. As you can see, here goes our line. I beefed up the line as well. So we have a lot of line. <clears throat> And we're going all out there with the pinfish. It's going, 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 going. And I'm gonna drop the video footage for you. So hopefully you could see when we drop it. Okay, let's see. There we go. So we're out there. Keep going, oh, okay. There you go, taking more line. And that should be good enough, I think. So I'm gonna close the bail right here, lock it up a little bit, and fly forward. And they should just drop the line, snap it. Yep, here we go. And just dropped, just like that.
okay here it comes back to us and that's it guys simple our reel all the way out there our bait our drone is coming back feet we went out to 800 feet literally so 800 feet is pretty good I mean I could have got more as much as my line allows me to so here comes my drone okay slowly as you can see I'm gonna drop it down the wire lead makes it stay down so it's safer and I'm gonna bring it down, hold my hand, and just turn it up. That's it. And we're back home, guys. Safely, our line all the way out in the deep, 800 feet. <laughs> That's pretty good. Gotta love that. Let's put the drone away, and let's do some fishing, man. Hopefully we catch something good. Guys, 800 feet with the drone, the one that I throw in live pinfish look at that <laughs> health is gone perfect bite just missed the hook man my god it was a crazy hit and that's it nothing else so i knew it got a huge bite well let's throw it out there again shoot, what do we got oh shoot oh my god that thing flew Oh, it just broke me off. It has to be a shark. Holy crap. Whee! That just broke me off. That was crazy. Oh my god. 30 pound line. Bye bye. Just broke me off with the live pinfish. Alright. That's a good whiting, guys. Alright. The first good fish of the day. Nice size whiting. No regulations on the whiting guy, so you could keep him. They are very tasty fish. I had the pump on the rig. I changed the hooks to circle hook number two and three. And boom, we got our first whiting. Very nice eating. So we're gonna throw that in our cooler. That's our angle 30 cooler. That's the 30 quarts. That's my fishing cart. You could find all those items that I use on my description below. I put all these items for you guys. It's there. I got my cooler packs, as you can see. These are awesome. It's called Cooler Shock. I don't use ice anymore. I use those all the time religiously, and it works perfect. It doesn't melt, it lasts me entire day. Sometimes I go 10 hours fishing. So anyways, all those items, gears, rod, reels, kayak, accessories, everything that I use on the description below. I do get a little bit commission from Amazon um, affiliated link. So I would appreciate it if you guys check it out. But let's keep fishing, man. We got our nice whiting. High tide coming in. Welcome to Florida, guys. Typical summer. One minute beautiful. Next minute, the crazy storm moving in. Look at that.
fish on. Oh yes. Fish on on the live pinfish. Oh, that sounds like a, oh man, stingray. It's staying down. Crap, I hope it's not stingray. Oh, what do we got? What do we got? A fish with the storm behind me. Oh, hopefully the storm will stay away. It swims like a stingray. Not much head shake. Seems like just kind of moving left and right. Let's see. Whoa. Yeah, I think that's a stingray. Oh, man. Oh, man, that storm right behind me. I gotta watch the lightning, too. I have a rod in my hand, 10 feet. <laughs> Not a good combination. Here we go. Here we go, right there. Right there. And here comes the rain. Woo! He got himself all sucked in. There we go. Right there, that's a big boy. That's a big boy. Yeah, buddy. Hold on, I'm gonna get you off, man. Hold on. Woo! Okay. Hi, right, guys. Here comes the rain. Woo! That stingray got me a good workout, man. But safe and sound, back in the water. The storm moving south. Probably see the right in the back. So I'm not touching my rods right now. I let him <laughs> be. And I'm gonna wait a little bit until the rain moves out. And keep fishing, man. This is what it's all about. Woo. Oh yeah. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. The rain almost stopped. I see the little sun peeking. And we got a bite. Come on, baby. What you got? Whiting. Oh, yes. Good size whiting. Woo -hoo! Look at that. That's a big boy. That is a big boy whiting. Yeah, baby. That was a good hit, too. On the live shrimp. <laughs> Look at that. Nice. Take it easy, baby. Take it easy. That's a good size, guys. Woo! Two whiting. It's gonna be a good dinner tonight. All right. Perfect. Whatever this is. Come on, baby. See a nice whiting. Good size whiting. It's a small, 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 small baby, baby croaker. How about that? <laughs> it hit like, it hit like a big fish. What? The... Okay, it's croaking away. Well, I'm going home, so otherwise I would have used you. I'm gonna let you go. Live another day, buddy. There we go. Croak away. See ya. Cast of the day. And I think we got something small. Under the rainbow. Probably a small croaker. Or whiting. Who knows. It is another croaker. Wow. 
They running, huh? Crazy. All right, buddy. We'll get you off. Thank you for playing. Go say hi to your family. And here comes the rainbow. Look at that. And if you guys can see on the GoPro, but it's a beautiful sight. Wow. Gorgeous. Turned out to be a gorgeous night, but it's getting dark. Time to go home.